What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Mike Rich, man. I'm out here in front of the uh, Tanger, 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 however you say it, outlets. Nike is way down there. Had to get a far parking spot this time. I'm going to Nike Outlet, Outlet Vlog Action. Y'all already know what it is. This is your boy Mike Rich. Uh, <laughs> I don't know, I'm being stupid today. Everybody out here getting this early shopping done, man. And it's kind of crazy. I ain't, I ain't been, it ain't been as crowded, crowded in a while as far as me going to the outlets. But let's go ahead and check, it, check out, see what they got in here. Maybe we can get some cop action going. Maybe we might get lucky today. Let's see what they got. Do it. I Chambray 7s, 2006 relief, very cleansed. Shout out to my boy Art Man for sending me these right here for free. Cause I did, I sure would have paid for these, but uh, shout out to him, man. Very cleansed though, dope on feet. Just uh, got the 89 jacket. Shout out to 89. Shout out my boy Figs. Loving the jacket, man. Very comfortable, very warm out here in this cool day. Just uh. See what's happening. So they already got the um, threes in here. I don't see no price on them. Somebody told me these threes was here, man, but um, they, ain't got my, they ain't got my size either. No 12s. And I don't know, it's at 11 and a half. That's the closest they got to my size. Damn, that's crazy, man. They ain't got no price, I wonder how much they is. Actually, they got a uh, 12 and a half right now. But they probably will. And they won the 85 though. That's basically retail, so I pass. I seen them online for like 150 on the finish line. So I pass on them. Then they got the uh, Charlotte 10s, which I already got. They actually got these. Man, these came out um, last year, right? I got these. I think they came out last year. 109. Gum bottom ones. Very dope. A very good price too, man. I wear these from time to time. And they pretty much got a full size run too. But um, they got the Kyrie and full size running parade joints for $100. You can't beat that. That's a very good price, right? That's a steal. Right? That's a steal right there. Cleansed. Just can't beat that, man. I'm not going to get them. I'm not going to get them. I kind of want them, but I'm not going to get I just bought the Krispy Kreme joint, so I'm, I'm chilling right now. And I ain't got my size. I wear 13 of these, so if I did want them, I wouldn't be able to get them. They don't have a 13 nowhere. This dude is, like, bumping into me right now. Go out of the way. Um, yeah, LeBron 13 for 84. Where's LeBron 14 yet? Y'all tell me. I, I ain't seen it. But they can have those, though. And whatever colorway that was, 139. They got the um, 16s, 17 pluses for 109, 169. And that's an extra 20 or 30% off of that. It's a size 13. These are too big for me. I need a 12. I still might try them on though. And the Kobe 10s. These weren't that bad. For $99 plus 20% off of that. Gang of these AJKO, you can't get these away. I saw these at Play Doh Closet for forty dollars. They a hundred plus twenty percent off. And um, also got the um, Letterman joints and smaller size, like eight and a half. Same price, a hundred plus twenty percent off. So eighty dollars basically. They, they try to thirteen zone. I mean, the 17 plus is on just to see how they fit. I haven't, I've never had this shoe, so I ain't know how it fit. This is size 13, that's the only side they got. Which I think. Man, they look kind of nice on feet. I'd rather have the coppers, man. I heard they had the coppers in here at some point, but they sold out on them. These will probably be come out to like 140 or something like that if I get them. I don't know. I ain't really have to have this shoe like that because this 13 is a little bit too big. My toe is like right there. 12, 12 and a half probably been perfect, but I don't know. I'm trying to make something out of nothing. I ain't just gonna buy something just because I just already got. No, sir. Give me some more of these uh, these joggers, man, because I um man, it's like a sweat material. I don't like that. But uh I've been wearing my black ones like this 
a lot and my gray ones like this um this is not the gray one i had but anyway i need to get more man because i've been wearing them things they're so comfortable man just been really rocking them lately yeah they have to be the tech fleece though because i slit and don't like the other kind i like the kinds that have the cuts right in the knees or the taper um man so, so like too. always when i go to the outlet and the vlog is going absolutely nowhere I go ahead and go to the mall, and I want to get a look at those um, supposedly Kobe 9 PEs. I don't really think, I think Randy Moss wore those. I think Randy Moss wore those in the game. I was looking through some old pictures. I seen Moss had um, had them specialized into cleats, of course, but um, go just want to get a look at them. You know, I think they're going to be sitting um, because they were still available online, so I think they will be sitting in the mall. Just get a closer look at them, see if that bluish purple actually looks purple. From what I'm hearing, people say it looks purple, so. I'm gonna check those out and um, I'm gonna see, I think my Foot Locker getting those Yeezys that's supposed to come out in a few days. So I'm gonna try to get like all three pair. <laughs> Y'all know I don't like these Yeezys, but the last Yeezys I got, the uh, version twos, the Beluga joints, um, I sold them and I was able to buy like three pair of sneakers that I wanted. So um, I ain't no reseller, but I will resell some Yeezys. That's for sure because people will pay, pay the money. And I, hey, I, I gotta do what I gotta do, man. It's helping me. Plus, um, like I said, I got my baby on the way. So it hit, really helped me out buying my kicks for the rest of the year, uh, selling those Yeezys, man. Um, you know, I want Space Jams, Nines, and I would be happy if I can just get all those without having to spend no extra bread out my pocket. So, anyway, um, Anyway, oh, son of mine, no. Anyway, I'm in this mall and I'm gonna see what's going on in here. Like, last time I came here, I got surprised and I was able to get those Krispy Kreme um, Kyrie 2s, which come to find out later, they weren't even supposed to be released. Like, nobody in mall is getting them to like 20 seconds, so I think they had to put them back up or something. I'm gonna see what's going on in there, man. But y'all already know I got on feet, man. Let's go ahead and see what's happening. Let's do it. So these are the Jordan 9s. Randy Moss action. The sneaker is actually very clean. Um, and it is purple. Like It is not blue at all in person. Actually, in person, it looks more purple than it looks on this camera. It still looks blue on the camera. But in person, it looks purple. That's crazy. It's not e The camera not even picking up the purple. I don't know if there's a different light. Yeah, but they dope, man. It's a pass for me. I'm going to get the OGs. Patent leather on the 9 just ain't, the, ain't really the move for me. They clean though, man. I ain't even lie, they clean. I just, I just can't do it. Waiting for the OGs. I think that's why these sitting too. A lot of people got, there's so much stuff coming out. Shoes like this ain't gonna sell out at all. Oh, these are dope right here, man. I like this, man. I really like these Harachis right here. These are dope. All Harachis usually go on sale though, so. And not no impulse buy action for 110. I ain't really got a hand right now, but I do like the colorway on them. Very, 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 very clean. And these just came out and they don't sell already. These Bo Jacksons are already a hundred dollars, man. So um try to see what I'm gonna do with some of these holiday releases and I might go back and cop a couple of these, man, for real, for real. Yeah, I remember these from back in the day, man. These some little mini, mini uh pine tree kickers right here. Uh, <laughs> somebody was telling me, man, you from that era, man. You supposed to like all the retro sneakers. Hey, I ain't gotta like all of it, man. I ain't like everything back then. I definitely ain't finna like everything now. I like the actual medial side better than the outside of the shoe so and i like the colorway too but i just i can't do the and they got the um these light bone um fit the cruise joints i don't know it, i don't know i just went able to copy a pair of these i just i don't know i tried them on they all right but i don't know the wheat ones were the best colorway so far in these man and they should have brought the red ones out too that would have been dope let's foot like i got them i'm gonna go ahead and see if they having these um if they gonna get these yeezys they got these uh, Air Force Ones too, these uh, wheat Air Force Ones. These are actually dope as well. Nice, nice, nice. Yes, uh. This one right here is dope though. I ain't even gonna lie. This colorway right here is, this wheat colorway ain't that bad. It's still a uh, pine tree kicker, but, but I would actually probably wear these right here, man. Um, these would definitely go on sale. You know they gonna go on sale. These gonna be like $100 in a few months, so I ain't even worried about it. But uh, yeah, I, I rock this colorway right here. It's kind of clean. And they also got the black joints, which I'm not really crazy about these. Those tan ones can get it though. Space Jam! Can you dig it? Yeah, 
the Jordan brand is overdoing it a little bit. They got space down there. So uh, the the um, Jordan Nines, they was all right. I just seen a dude actually in the mall with a mall man, and he was walking like he was walking like Frankenstein. <laughs> like he, I guess he wasn't trying not to crease him. You know what I'm saying? I feel him on that. I do that from time to time. Everybody is guilty of that when they rock new kicks. But um, uh, they they was all right. I think one of the reasons they didn't sell out was um, well. The, the hol holiday releases and plus general release joints don't really sell out no more anyway but they really weren't gonna sell out with all these uh holiday releases coming out and stuff like that people saving their money for that and then they buy other stuff going shopping and stuff like that plus if it would have actually been a pe like i think if randy moss i never seen kobe widows and i seen randy moss wear them so if it would have had like randy moss's number on the back of them you know that would have made gave it more of that pe feel like, i think it's just, it just seemed like a regular jordan you know or a new jordan colorway or whatever that's how people uh, a lot of people look at it, especially People who not in the um the uh collector space like we are, but oh, I just I just bought some jeans, man. This place called um C Gen in there, like C Generation or whatever, I guess. They have like good quality jeans for good price, so I got some olive um kind of like I'm trying to they tattered, so you probably can see that a little bit. Olive tattered jeans. You know, I tried those on in there, they was they was pretty dope, man. Like I said, nothing, just boring stuff, man. And I went to Levi's at um an outlet my wife, my wife called interior looking kind of cleanse man i like that but uh, anyway i got just like a regular pair of blue jeans some uh 511s man just a little bit of a tapered fit on them uh because i've been I, like a lot of jeans that i own man they swallow up my sneakers man they just fall all over my shoes and that they be looking sloppy to me but anyway anyway uh that's it being your boy mike rich i hope y'all enjoyed this vlog regardless of me not you know getting kicks or not or whatever uh, just a lot of a lot of stuff I saw, like the Marachis and those uh those wheat colored sneakers in there, man. It's a lot of stuff that I kinda like. This shirt getting too big for me, man. It just keep falling off. But um but holiday releases, man. I just trying to want to get them nip, nipped in the bud. I'm I'm trying to get those Yeezys so I can hey, I ain't gonna lie, to resell them, man. You know, people buying them, spending all that money on them. You spend seven, eight hundred dollars on a pair of Yeezys, and I only spent two hundred dollars on them or two twenty, how much they in. And I can pay for like the rest of my sneaker for the rest of the year. That's what I'm gonna do, man. Ain't nobody sending me free kicks, man. So, you know what I'm saying? I gotta get it how I live for real, though. But anyway, man, I appreciate y'all watching this video, man. Y'all hit that thumbs up, like, subscribe, and all that good stuff. And keep watching my video, because that's what I'm here for. Gone.